Hey, hey, what's going on, guys? What's going on? Woo! Welcome to Calm Vibes. It's Jay, and I got another for you. So, the press is out, and it's all over the world. 300 plus pound women say they deserve high value men. All right. So, what do the high value men think about that? All right. So they say they deserve it. So let's let's see why. All right. So let's run it. Let's see why. Okay. So, so man, hold on, hold on, don't, don't, don't. So you're about the size of a, a fullback. <laughs> okay. You weigh more. I mean, we don't even have fullbacks anymore. Mike Allstott would be proud. You weigh more than a man at your height. And as a matter of fact, you weigh twice as much as you should. And that is something that is 100% in your control. Accountability. Right. So, I'm single for another two years, and that's what it is. Because the person that is for me is going to take me right now at being a little over 300 pounds. Because no! then in the future when I look at you, I can say you deserve me now at my best. Because this isn't my best. My best is yet to come. But you should earn and deserve me at my best. No! And that's the problem. A lot of people don't want to put the work into people that don't look like they're worth the work. How much proof do you So need? I'm currently not dating uh, for the first time in for Like, first time ever. I've always been dating. Always as in like on... Uh, apps and stuff because you know I don't like to be alone I like the attention whenever I start to feel insecure I would go on the apps and have someone call me pretty not force them but you know like someone's gonna call me pretty and just feel good about myself like okay I'm good now but you know I want to get to a stage where I don't need that baby can I no ma'am what in the holy butterfly uh Princess in the diary. Here's you got on no ma'am. Don't do it no more. I've been watching you and I'm kind of confused. Like you speak on like bigger women and stuff like that. And I'm a bigger woman. Like I definitely have curves and stuff like that. And I know that it's important to be healthy. But why should me being big stop? a high-value man from wanting me. Because like, they don't want you? Okay. Then you, you just said it. Why should somebody who's up here, who's put in the work, care about what somebody who's down there ain't put in the same kind of work? True. Hold on, that... hold on, hold on. I'll let you speak. Un Unadulted. A man puts his work in outside and competing in the world, making himself high-value. A woman puts her work in in the gym. And in the mirror to look good for him because that's what men value not only but that's where it starts so you asking why and why should that preclude you because where in the world do men who are already high value as the norm pick big women what if i was like on my way like uh 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 uh, uh. where in the world do men who are already high value pick big women?
Okay, okay. I'm just having some fun. I guess that sums it up, though. Uh, they're not looking for obese women. So let's just get away from all that, ladies, and just get in the gym. You know, like he said, a lot of you spend a lot of time worrying about, you know, the head shot up, you're in the mirror, but you're not in the gym for the rest of your body. And just, just get real. You know, you want you want to have the whole package. You don't want to just have a, you know, a nice looking head, but the rest of your body you don't care about. But if you're looking for a high value man, you in competition. So you got to always remember that you in competition with other women. So if they're looking better, why shouldn't he want them? Why should he want a woman that's looking her well, looking worse than all the other? You wouldn't go to a car lot and buy the, the, the ugliest car on the lot. So why would I pick the less attractive woman when I can actually get a attract, you know, a more attractive woman? And that just being real. So, I mean, you can get in your feelings about it, but it ain't going to change shit. Let's just be real. But no need to spend a lot of time on it. This car, <laughs> this come by. I can't stop left this last one. This calm vibes and this J. And we up out of here. Don't forget, hit that subscribe and that thumbs up. And let me hear that comment that you guys gonna um, what you think about this. Ladies, y'all can hit it up, comment on it. Shit. You know, maybe you can get something out of it. Maybe we get a conversation going. All right. But it is what it is. Man down. 911. People, peace.